Hola mis amigas y bienvenidos a La Bonita Punta Cana. Me llamo Taylor Jones and I will be giving you all my experience and review at the Rio Palace Punta Cana in the Dominican Republic.
You guys, we are enjoying our stay at the resort. Now we're gonna go to the beach and relax some more. And then we're gonna go to the Ryu pool party around four or five o'clock and have some fun there. So now we are eating at the steakhouse. We just got our appetizers. Yeah, we got our seafood. I mean, Caesar salad, and then we got our seafood trio. Cameron, you know some seafood trio? Um, I don't know, but it looks like shrimp. In the seafood trio, everyone. Say it again, Mama. Octopus, prawns, and shrimp. Delicioso. And Taylor is trying octopus for her first time. Are you ready? I'm scared. All right. Hi, uh, three, two, one. Okay. It's okay. chilling. Chewing? But it's a very good bite. Octopus is good. Should I try it, y'all? I think you should try it. All right, y'all. I really don't taste nothing, but the bite's good.
are now eating the food and I could say it's pretty good. Like I got calamari, mussel, shrimp, noodles, rice, with the beef, like roast beef, and um, some chicken, and um, it's pretty delicious. What do you got? Workers go there after work. That's good. They got a place to go to and chill with the, um, you know, the people here. Mm -hmm. It was definitely fun. I would go back. Yeah. Would go back. Hi, you guys, we are on our way to the white party at the Rio pool party, and you know we have to celebrate and turn up. You guys ready? Yeah. You ready, mom? Ready. Let's get it. Ready to white. Yeah, she's ready to do it. <laughs> But it's our last night. We have to turn up at the best party there is in the Kana. So, what else place to go than the rock party? It's that Coco Bongo. Coco Bongo. Yeah, Coco Bongo. We'll go there next time.
my experience at the resort, and honestly, I had the best time of my life there. And shout out to my mom for the graduation present. It was amazing. So what was great about the resort was that it was inclusive. So I would give this place a straight five out of five stars. With inclusive, we got our meals included for free and then also the drinks. And there were shows and entertainment there that you could relax and enjoy, which was nice as well. The environment at the resort was really nice that me and my family liked. The beach was amazing. We have not been on a beach in forever. So being on that beach during that time felt relaxing. The employees were so friendly to talk to. And if you spoke to them in Spanish, they were gonna to speak to you right back in their native tongue. And I feel as though it's nice, honestly, if you're traveling out the country and you're going somewhere else, and if you know a little bit about your language, cause why not? And you'll learn something. What was also a bonus about this trip was that we met people from all around the world, like Spain, Wales, Germany, and France. And talking to them and seeing you know, how long they're staying was really nice. We met the guy from Wales that was staying at the resort for like two weeks. And then he was gonna go to China for like three weeks. So that was pretty interesting to learn about him. Unfortunately, we did not go on any excursions. But if we do go back to Punta Cana or who knows elsewhere, we're definitely going on excursions for sure. I feel as though that would have been a nice bonus as well to the trip. But all in all, we still had a fun time. But thank you guys so much for watching my first out of the country and my very first vlog. It was honestly hard vlogging, you know, having the camera on all the time, making sure I'm getting all the videos that I needed. It was definitely a challenge, but I would definitely do it again. And where should I go next? We'll see next summer. All right, y'all, I'll see you later. Bye.